the moment of a force is the turning effect that a force produces about a pivot. So here we have a pivot on the seesaw center and this mass at one end of the seesaw is pushing downwards with a weight force and that downwards weight force is creating a turning effect about the pivot and we say it's creating a moment. So how do we calculate the, the moment or the turning effect? Well, the greater the force, the greater the turning effect and the greater the perpendicular distance from the line of action of the force to the pivot, so the greater the perpendicular distance, that's the 90 degrees distance from the line of action of the force to the pivot, then the greater the moment will also be. So the equation which links all this together is that the moment or the turning effect is equal to the turning force that's being applied multiplied by the perpendicular distance from the line of action of the force to the pivot. So let's pop this down on the uh, flashcard answer side now. I'll just use this bit here but you can use your answer side. So M is the moment and the units will be, well we'll come back to that in just a moment. Ah, no pun intended. Sorry about that. F is the turning force and the units of force is always Newtons or capital N. D is the perpendicular perpendicular distance. So there we are, the perpendicular 90 degrees distance from the line of action. From the line of action of the force. So there's our line of action and the distance is at 90 degrees to the pivot and the units can vary but usually we'd use meters or little m. So what would be the units of a moment, a turning force? Well let's look at the equation. We've got newtons multiplied by meters and so the units of a moment are newton meters. Now notice there is no per here. It's not newtons per meter. It is just straightforward newton meters. All one thing. Bit of a strange unit I know. And the shortening would be capital N little m. Notice that you can sometimes use centimeters instead of meters. Um, and that's okay just for this once we can use centimeters so the unit of moments would therefore be Newton centimeters but usually you'll be using Newton meters so that is the equation linking the turning effect the moment of a force and the perpendicular distance from the force to the pivot